In this video we're going to be talking about the Norton V4 SS, the Chrome Edition, the ultra rare version. I'm going to tell you what I like about it and what I don't. So first of all, let's talk about the positives on this motorcycle and what I love about it. First of all is the striking design and I love the chrome finish, it just looks stunning. And with it being the chrome one as well, it makes it extremely rare. With Norton they've used the best components, so they've used Brembo brakes, Olin suspension, OZ wheels, and then they put a modern touch on it as well with the TFT screen and the keyless go. And let's talk about the performance figures as well. 195 brake horsepower and 200 miles an hour. There's some serious figures. And little bits on the bike which I've noticed as well. It's like the leather seat. They've done the quilted leather seat like you'd see on an Aston Martin with all the red stitch and beautiful patriotic British flag on the back. It just, every, everything just works on the bike. It, it's a stunning piece. So let's talk about the things we don't like about this motorcycle. Sadly, Norton haven't got it right with the chrome finish. The early ones were all wrapped and they were turning like a bit of a yellow, yellow tinge to it and then they decided to paint them and from a distance the bike looks absolutely incredible then you get close up and you can see you know suddenly there's a few little runs in the paint you can see the, like little silicon marks all under the paintwork which, which just spoils it a little for, bit for me really the quality is just not quite there I can see here how the front doesn't quite fit right around the screen um, there's just bits and pieces where you just look and it's just you know it, and it's such a shame because they've made an incredible job of designing this beautiful machine but suddenly they've just not got it right for the chrome however for a future collector this is the way I would look at it because the chrome ones were so rare and a lot of them were going back to the factory and they were swapping them for the carbon edition where we've had a few of those in the showroom this for me is the ultimate for the collectors because these in my opinion because they're so rare these were a great investment opportunity 